Hey guys, let's get more news about Warriors, but first, don't forget to subscribe and leave your like. Chris Paul goes through full practice with Warriors, nears return. Chris Paul, who has been out since injuring his hand on January 5 and undergoing surgery, is close to a return. Paul went through a full five-on-five -five practice with the team and, while he is not playing Thursday night against the Lakers, he should return soon, coach Steve Kerr told reporters on Wednesday. He's doing great. Just played five-on-five, -five, took part in our whole practice. He's getting close. He won't play tomorrow, but he's feeling really good. He played a lot over the All-Star break, he told me, so the next step is for the training staff to get a feel for where he is conditioning-wise and just make sure everything is set for him to be out there. Paul was injured against the Pistons in early January when he went for an offensive rebound and ran into Jaden Ivey. He underwent surgery to repair a fractured metacarpal in his left hand days later. Paul had propped up the bench units, averaging 8.9 points and 7.2 assists a game, and more importantly, the team is plus 8.9 points per 100 possessions when he is on the court, the Warriors have long struggled in their non-curry minutes. Paul and now Clay Thompson coming off the bench give the Warriors a chance to have a strong second unit and make a push up the standings during the final sprint of the regular season. Warriors owner addresses push to trade for LeBron James. Warriors owner Joe Lacob is a man that wants to win, and trading for LeBron James was certainly going to help his chances of that. Earlier this month it was reported by ESPN that the Dubs inquired about a LeBron trade, but the idea was not entertained by the Lakers. Lacob was asked to comment on his team's push for LeBron, and he made one thing very clear. I'm not going to comment on something I can't comment on, but, in general, I just want to win, Lacob told ESPN. We want to be the best, and we're going to try whatever tactic it takes to get there. I am not here to screw around. We are not here to screw around. We are not here to be just some team. We're not going to do that. We may fail. Everyone fails. We may fail occasionally but it will not be for lack of trying. In the same interview, the strong-minded owner also rejected the idea of his team bottoming out. He cited Golden State as a coveted landing spot for free agents, which is why that won't ever happen. It's the reason that I don't think we will ever, ever try to bottom out, Lacob said. We are the Golden State Warriors. I believe in the culture. I believe that word gets out. I could go on and on. I'm not trying to brag. I'm just saying, that's who we are. We're never going to bottom out. I won't settle for that. We're not doing that. Many NBA insiders have predicted that the Warriors aren't done trying to get LeBron, so watch the space. The Warriors are 10th in the West, with a 27-26 record on the season, but have won 8 of their last 10 games. Trade Option for Luka Donich Luka Donich gave a very different interview, so trade options began to appear in several rumors. It is worth remembering that, in the 2021-22 season, the Mavericks went to the West Finals and only stopped at the Golden State Warriors. And it was for a team that won its fourth title in eight years. So, as Dallas did so well, the Slovenian appeared as the favorite for the MVP this year. According to the bookmakers, no one beat him. But in the last edition of the race for the MVP, he was only fifth. Shortly after the Kyrie Irving trade, some journalists speculated about Donich's patience with the franchise. That's because the Mavs needed big box players, especially good rim defenders. Then, Irving arrived to share the offensive responsibility, the opposite of what was necessary. Now, there is a real chance he will ask for a trade. Let's start from one principle in all exchange options for Luka Donich, whoever is in line for him must take Davis Bertans. So, we are talking about 57 million US dollars in salaries, from 2023-24. The Warriors want a player like Donich to be their big name. He is an established star, 
a candidate for MVP every year and who would make a total difference to the team, whether financially, shirt sales, for example, or on the court. It is obvious that Warriors would be one of the options to trade for Luka Doncic. Nikola Jokic and Luka Doncic are two of the best players in the NBA today. The stars are friends off the court, but on it, the bonding only lasts for the All-Star game, as it was last weekend. But still, there are those who want them together, whether on the Denver Nuggets or Dallas Mavericks. However, Nikola Jokic tried to rule out any chance of him going to Texas to play with Luka Doncic. Champion for the Nuggets, the pivot assured that he wants to continue with the franchise. But, in the same way, he did not rule out a partnership with the star. To do this, therefore, the Slovenian would have to leave his current team. Donic, on the other hand, hasn't had much stability since arriving in Dallas. In his six seasons with the Mavs, the star reached the playoffs on three occasions. In one of them, until the finals. However, in the last one, with the expectation of joining Kyrie Irving, he ended up far from the postseason. In the current campaign, the situation is better, with 32 wins in 55 games and 7th place in the West. Still, the franchise is not among the favorites for a title. Even so, in January, the point guard signaled confidence in his team. After all, he sees himself in good condition alongside Irving and Derek Lively too. Therefore, considering them the big three of the franchise. Furthermore, he explained that injuries hampered the current campaign. Therefore, Dallas could be even better on the table. It was a serious injury crisis, there was always someone missing and it was always someone important. In my opinion, we are even closer to being in perfect shape and at least reasonably healthy now. Especially our big three, as we would say here. We play very few together in matches, even less in training. We still need to get used to it, even though we are already in the second half of the regular season, he said. And you, fan, what do you think of the situation about Luka Donich? Leave your opinion in the comments.